Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Sonali. Welcome to a new weekend in my life vlog. I honestly tried to film a week in my life this past week, but it just wasn't it. I just like stopped vlogging because I was finishing up on some grad galleries and just getting all of my Italy vlogs up. So this is like the first vlog you're going to see after my Italy vlog. And I'm really excited about all of them. I feel like they turned out really good and I'm so happy to like have those memories forever now that I've like, you know, filmed them. And that's why I love vlogging because I can literally see vlogs from my freshman year of college and I feel like that's just so special to me. It's like home videos, but just like online for everyone to see. But it's also exciting to like share those moments with you guys. So I'm glad you guys are loving them. And if you haven't checked them out, definitely do so. Today is Friday and I finish sending out my last graduation gallery. If you guys didn't know, I am a photographer and I specialize in grads here at UT Austin. And so graduation is literally this Saturday and I did not want to come anywhere close to campus within a week of graduation. So I kind of just stopped doing grad photos um, like a week before, I think, yeah. I think it was like before I went to Dallas and then I just like cut them off because I did not want to deal with any traffic. I don't want to deal with that many people on campus. So now I'm going to be focusing on branding mini sessions, which is really exciting. It's coming up on June 4th. If you guys are in the Austin area, need business or lifestyle headshots for your social profiles, if you're a real estate agent, if you have a small business, or if you just want some nice photos of you for like your dating profiles or anything like that, um, hit me up on my photo account. I'll have the little at sign here and I can tell you more info about that, but it's going to be in this amazing studio space. I'm going to post some photos here that I've taken at that studio. It's just like really bright and airy. She also has added a lot more like setups and just more colorful setups if that's what you're looking for. So it's definitely going to be a lot cheaper than my normal rate. So if you guys have been wanting to shoot with me or just need some branding photos, let me know ASAP. I'm doing $50 off those sessions until next Friday. So this vlog will definitely be up by then. So let me know ASAP. I thought I would start this vlog off with an Amazon haul because I feel like I have these phases where I go crazy on Amazon and buy so many random stuff. Um, things that I need, but also, you know, things that I want. So I thought we could go through it together. I'm going to set you guys on my tripod and let's do this unboxing. We got many packages to unbox. And honestly, the next thing I need to get is a box cutter. I think this is already open. Sophie, I got you a present. <laughs> got some pee pads. Like Sophie, look. I got you a present. You're welcome. Be a little bit more grateful. Jeez. What is this? Oh, I got this. Screen cleaning mist. My computer is so disgustingly dirty all the time. My friend Nagin had like the most clean computer screen at Soho House when we went last week and I was like, how do you keep your computer screen so clean? And she basically said she was really OCD and never touches it when I'm over here like touching it all the time. I don't know why, it's literally not a touch screen. So I'm excited to try this thing out. It's apparently, let me show you guys. This bottle is a spritz spray and then you can actually like wipe it off with this, which is so genius, I thought. My hands are just always so greasy from makeup and oils. I douse myself and oils at the end of the night. Okay, this is actually my Skims order and this is perfect because I had to tell you guys about these shirts that I ordered. Actually, I ordered one, but then I loved it so much that I had to get two more and they're like always sold out so I had to run to get them. So these are the boyfriend tee from Skims and I cannot explain to you how soft they are and I'm like not even exaggerating. It's probably like the softest pajamas I'll ever have besides the Everge pajamas, but like I love sleeping in just like a big old t-shirt. So the size I got in the other one was an XL and these are actually two XLs because that's all I really had, but I think it's going to be perfect as a sleep shirt. So I got this color and I also just got this like heathered gray color, which reminds me of like all my sorority tees, but that's totally fine. Um, I'm going to link everything down below if you guys are interested, but seriously, do not sleep on these skims boyfriend tees this next package is a shoe box so this is what these look like i love a good toe loop i don't know why i think it's just like the indian in me because like a lot of sandals have these little toe loops i just think it's so classy it's kind of like a toe ring and i want to get some toe rings and anklets for the summer i just think it's so cute and it accessorizes your ankles and feet a little bit more i am currently suffering with a 
little boo-boo on my foot from another pair of shoes that gave me not it wasn't even a blister but it was just like rubbing really hard so it kind of like got raw and now it's scabbed over and now it hurts to wear anything but sneakers so amazing but these seem really comfortable they're like kind of squishy so i'm excited to try these out they look super freaking cute okay so these are oh i didn't really think that they would be like this yellow color they're very yellow in person so i might have to exchange them but they're another pair of these like slack pants i love these slack pants especially for summer you can dress them up you can dress them down they're kind of like flared at the ends but basically they're kind of like work pants and I just think they are so flattering because they're high-waisted. They come up on like the perfect point on like my torso. Um, and I can wear like bodysuits and crop tops with them. The camera really doesn't pick up like the yellowness of it. So I'm going to have to exchange this pair of pants. Next up are kind of similar shorts to the pants that I just showed you guys. I just really like this like pleated style i just think it's very flattering and i love the like a-line style of these shorts i have like some denim shorts like that and they are so flattering not at all tight like the most comfortable thing to wear during the summer months so i'm very excited to try these on again a neutral kind of color to match with like a white or like another nude tank top i actually bought a new tank top i think it's still on its way over okay this is going to be a good one i just know it it's a jumpsuit but it's a one shoulder jumpsuit and it has like two straps in the back they're actually adjustable which is amazing because i feel like that really says a lot about the quality already um and then the back has this really nice um material what is this like ruching i never know what it's called um but then i feel like i won't really have to wear a bra with this which is awesome and then again with the flared pants it is a jumpsuit so there are like separated legs but holy crap i need to put this on like asap i want to film like what i got on amazon tiktoks and stuff like that so i'll probably do the shoes those shorts and this romper or jumpsuit whatever they're called um i thought i got more oh there we go okay i think one more Yay! Okay, here it is. This is like the tank top thing that I was just talking about. I really hope this fits because how cute is this little tube top? I haven't worn a tube top in years, but like I love this and I wonder if it's like too much of the same color to wear it with these shorts. Actually, I feel like it would be really cute because it's a monochromatic look. This is like a tad bit darker. So that's everything I got. I thought I got more for some reason. I guess that box, I just thought there was more stuff in it, but it's Sophie's pee pads. I hate when I get Sophie's food in the lockers downstairs because we like Amazon Prime her food. Sometimes it's like annoying to find at grocery stores. So we just have the subscription on Amazon. But like whenever I get her food, I'm like, ooh, what did I order? Like Amazon, yay. And then it's just her food. I'm like, gosh dang. <laughs> So today we have a reservation at a new restaurant called Makoko. I think that's how you pronounce it. It's on the east side. It's on the east side. And since it's graduation weekend for UT, I was like, okay, if we want to eat out this weekend, we have to have reservations, which is honestly every weekend. Like Austin is really, really getting a little too crowded. Um, so it kind of sucks that it's like that. But I... I'm thankful that I thought about that on Monday. So I just made it like a reservation for tonight at that place and then tomorrow night. But I just found out that one of my favorite, favorite restaurants is shutting down on their uh, downtown location. If you guys are in Austin, it's called Gloria's. And like that would be our go-to spot. Like if we are going on Lady Bird Lake the whole day and then we're just like, okay, let's meet up at Gloria's, get some marks, get some like Latin food and maybe go out after because it's like right on west and they're shutting down and i'm so freaking sad apparently the rent is going up like crazy also speaking about rent <laughs> we got our rent renewal this past week i think i was actually in dallas when it came through our door and like low-key we might have to move because i think it went up like 400 dollars or a little bit less than 400 dollars, but still 400 dollars and I know I'm very lucky to be like living with Ryan and being able to split it. But, like to think about like the rent we paid when we first got here and we thought that was expensive and now it's just reaching so high up and we were trying to negotiate it, but 
we were not able to unfortunately because the market price is so much higher than like even the newer rent that we're gonna pay um so we like still need to decide and what sucks even more is that we literally have until next Friday to like decide if we're going to move out or renew or whatever and so that's not even like enough time to like really tour other places and like yeah we would love to buy a house right now but that is impossible here in Austin um, unless you want to go out to the burbs which not for me right now like I am 25 I need to be living in the city I'm just not ready for that life I have my whole life to live in the suburbs so I'm just like not even entertaining that idea whatsoever um, so I know Austin is booming right now and that's kind of just like the consequences of that and just like living here and I guess everywhere honestly I know a lot of cities are like just booming and the rents going up so it really does suck and I really really like where I live so we do have to make that decision pretty quick which makes it even harder um, but yeah we may have to move and I'm just like heartbroken I literally had to throw myself a pity party for two whole days about it because I was just really just like upset um, I mean Austin like I said it's just becoming so crowded um, and I don't know it's just really sad we got a little growth on my cactus there's like a little cactus growing outside my cactus which is not really what I wanted but that's okay um, I also forgot that I had another Amazon package and some beauty products were in it. Got a new roller lash by Benefit. This is like my ride or die mascara. It's pretty much in every makeup routine I've had for the past few years. And then I wanted to try out this JVN hair oil. Um, a while back during South by Southwest, JVN had a pop up and they were giving free like blowouts or like hairstyles, whatever you wanted. And they were trying out like all their JVN products on people's hair. And I was completely sold. The only reason I didn't buy it is because I have so much like PR at home, like hair products that I need to like get through before I can like buy another one. I mean, I could always get rid of them or like give them away, give them to friends and family, um, or just like a donation center also it kind of sucks because last week i was giving away some clothes like i had my mom go through it i had some friends go through it and then i was just going to give the rest to a women's shelter i went in like i think it's called the safe alliance and they said that they weren't taking used items and i'm like but they're clean like just take it please um but yeah they weren't taking used items and i'm not sure when they're gonna start so i just gave it to goodwill and i really wanted to start giving it to women's shelters but I asked her, I was like, are all women's shelters doing that right now? And she was like, yeah, pretty much because of COVID. But I wanted to try this out on camera. So it says, apply to dried hair. The silky silicone free oil instantly adds an incredible gloss without adding weight. And honestly, when they use this on my hair in the salon, I was like, okay, that's the product. Like if I'm buying anything from JVN, I'm getting this. And I was like, you know what? Let me just see on Amazon. Um, if they had it because also they gave me a tiny sample when I went in store and then I remember packing for Italy and I thought I put this in like the sample in my makeup bag or hair care bag I couldn't find it and I was so mad so I was like okay you know what I'm just gonna buy it on Amazon anyways let's get to the demo shall we just gonna do a little bit at a time doesn't really have like too much of a scent honestly but like it's not super like thick the viscosity isn't really thick I'm like kind of scared because I don't really want to put too much product I just Dyson air out to my hair for the first time in so long and I feel like whenever I have product in my hair it like weighs it down and then like the curls fall a lot faster um, but they really sold me on this product because they were like this actually kind of just can penetrate the hair more than like the Olaplex oil can because the molecules are a lot smaller on this product. I was just kind of mind blown when they were like telling me all the science behind JVN products. Um, so I want to try more of them out, but like I said, I got a lot to go through before I can do that. Um, okay, right now I want to film some TikToks. I haven't been able to do that for a really long time and it honestly like makes me so happy when I like actually create video content. I'm very excited that grad season's over even though, you know, 
I'm very grateful to have all these clients and I dreamt of the day to have this many clients honestly like when I first moved here I was like I want to do grads and I was so lucky that UT does grad pictures because not every college really does it which I've learned over the past years um but anyways so I'm very grateful for all my clients but I'm just excited to like have my social life back have my work routine back have just my wellness routine back because I kind of stopped working out because I was on campus doing grad shoots like literally four times a day max and that's like a lot of energy because you're like literally walking around in the, in the heat so anyways I'm very excited to just like get back to everything so let's just create some TikToks let's do it we're about to head to dinner and here's the fit literally just the same rib tank top from earlier today I love it it's going to be my new go-to during the summer. It's an Aritzia tank top. I'll link it down below. And then I have this Princess Polly cardigan. My favorite jeans from like Silver Lake Co. I think they're from Nordstrom. Um, then my purse that I got in Venice. Ryan was about to come to date night in gym shorts and flip-flops. Austin. I know, but that? still. There's no rules. There isn't, but... I'm still wearing mixed match socks. <laughs> Past few times I've actually used the Dyson Airwrap and it's been raining without my knowledge. <laughs> I did not see this on the forecast. I know it's raining Sunday, but I didn't see that it was supposed to be raining today. At least it's gonna clear up like within like 10 minutes probably. I see like the beautiful blue skies. Um, but we are excited for dinner. I've had this place on my bucket list saved. Not for like too long because it's actually pretty new, um, but they have these churro donuts that really enticed me. So hopefully all of their food is really good, but I'm just really here for the churro donuts. Dinner was really good. I got a carne asada taco. We got like a bunch of appetizers. That taco was really, really good. I would definitely go back for it. Churro donuts were so good. And we have like a couple that we took home. Um, and now I'm going out. Got my summer moon cup that I washed out because I, I want to dispose of this, but I put tequila and my marg mix in there. And I'm gonna head to my friend Maddie's house and then we're gonna meet our friends out on West or Rainy. I think it's Rainy. But I think one of my friends are going to Rainy and then another girl is going to West. So we shall see where we end up. But I Dyson air up to my, what is that? Why does it look crimped? That is weird. Wait, that is literally weird. I Dyson air up to my hair. It should not look like that because my natural hair is not crimped. Anyways. I mean, it still looks like good, which is not very curled as it was, which sucks. But I am wearing this new shirt I got on Amazon. Oh yeah, wait, I literally unboxed it in today's vlog. Um, this is what it looks like on. It is kind of falling down. I probably would size down. I got a size large and I'd probably go for a medium just so you don't have to like pull it up. It's not horrible though. And it is so freaking cute. It is just a shirt, not a bodysuit. Got my Abercrombie jeans on and Dolce Vita shoes. This little bag I have not worn, Sinbono. All jewelry. I'm literally showing you guys my hair tight. Okay, jewelry is from Goriana, except for this one, it's from Amazon. It's so cute. Okay, gonna go out and enjoy the rest of the night. I'll see you guys tomorrow. So it's actually Sunday. Yesterday I was a tad bit hungover and also we didn't do shit except for go to the pool. So today is our Saturday redemption. <laughs> um, but we're gonna start off by going to Gloria's downtown. I think I said it in this vlog, but they're closing that location down, which is so heartbreaking because that is like our place to go with our friends. So it's really sad. We're gonna go there for lunch today, meet up with Mackenzie and Connor and get some yummy food in our system. I have not eaten anything and I'm pretty, pretty hungry. Um, and then we're gonna go to the Domain. And then later tonight we have like this uh, cocktail event. I guess they're showing new cocktails at Devil May Care. Your shoes are so sweet. <laughs> Your shoes are like freaking Squidward shoes, <laughs> sir. Yeah, whatever. Anyways, 
it shall be a fun day today and i put on makeup feeling good definitely feeling a lot better than yesterday um it wasn't even like anything major but just like anything a tad bit out of the normal just makes me not want to do anything you know outfit of the day i have this top from amazon it's literally like the same exact set active top but the whole set is 35 dollars. i will link it in the description it's crazy it's such a good seal um and i have like the exact same set i've compared them and i'm telling you they're so so similar um i think the color might be a little bit off but there are a bunch of colors that you can get this in um anyways this white button down is from princess polly it's like my go-to for the summer months and then we have these jean shorts from a gold day so comfortable and then i'm wearing some shoes from girlfriend collective so all right let's go Hello. <laughs> Last time, best time. Are we gonna miss it or what? Yes. <laughs> they still have their domain location. I know, literally. <laughs> just got done eating at Gloria's and it was very sad. It was actually really good our last time. Sometimes like when you force the last time, you know, it's just not as good as usual. So I'm glad it was really good. Um, and we caught up with Mackenzie and Connor. And now we are at the domain because I'm going to do a collaboration on TikTok with um, a brand here. They're gifting me a swimsuit. I think we made um, some Memorial Day plans, which is next weekend to go to this like lake access kind of thing and it looks so cool i literally want to go today because i'm so excited i love swimming and just being like near the water so i'm pumped for that i hope it all works out and i'll definitely vlog it because i it's really really pretty over there um yeah it's definitely gonna be busy that's why i literally told mackenzie i was like we need to leave early because i feel like whenever we tell our friend group like we're gonna do like a water activity we always end up being out there by like two and then parking's impossible. There's just so many people and it's just a lot. I mean, it's still fun, yeah, you know? Mackenzie, you're watching. Yeah, Mackenzie. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's like all of us, honestly. Um, we just always say we're gonna be there at this time and then we're like always all late, like literally everyone. But um, yeah, so I'm very excited to try on these swimsuits because then I'll get to wear it next weekend. And it's really weird because today is like literally, well, I just looked at the temperature, it was 81, now it's 84, but um, it's like kind of cold outside. Not cold, like 75. a little breeze. It's 75. Mm -hmm. it's so weird because I just saw in New York, it's like 87. We're like switching um, mm -hmm. temperatures it was today. It a bad storm last night, it was really bad. Oh. I went to the gas station last night and it was like blowing the doors open my like it can't even drive the trees were like what the heck lightning was crazy and then it's gonna rain like Monday Tuesday and Wednesday I think mm. so just, that kind of sucks but we're gonna enjoy the nice weather the domain's always a good place to go when the weather's really nice out because it's an outdoor mall a nap after we came back from the domain because i was very sleepy and then i put together some outfits and we're gonna go out shooting i haven't done this in so long but i have a content creation gig like i don't have to post about it but i'm just taking photos for the brand for pedal and pup so this is one of the outfits very cute very like puffy sleeves cottage core vibes um and then i have another stunning dress like it fits me so well i'm so pumped about it um and then i just brought a couple of other outfits if we have time to shoot those and then we're gonna go to an event i think i said this before but it's at devil may care um they're launching some new cocktails so they invited me and ryan to try those out and then after that we need to get our house Monday ready because it's kind of a pigsty and it's all of my stuff. <laughs> so I just need to like do a little quick pickup. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it for today. And I did this little hair thing. Basically put a clip in my hair or like I tied it in a half a path down and then I clipped it kind of like upside down and it gives this like illusion of like a really puffy, bouncy kind of like half up. I think it's really cute. Um, I just like never do anything different to my hair when I take photos and I want to start doing that But I feel like I'm always rushed 
So I thought I would just do it for the first outfit and then take my hair down and do something else. We'll figure it out. But this is the look and we are gonna go shoot. I think we're gonna do East Austin. I feel like that's just easy. did three outfits, which is good enough. I feel like that should last me. And I'm wearing my little Amazon tube top again because I didn't get any really good pictures in it. And I just got some really cute ones. Thank you to Ryan. And now we are going to head to Double Make here. We passed by Gloria's again. It's just very sad, you know? First bungalow, now Gloria's. Why do they gotta take this shit away from us? back home I got my devil may care merch on they gave us like t-shirts which was kind of nice because I'm never gonna say no to a big old sleep shirt um, but I'm gonna take off my makeup and just chill out before the week starts and definitely clean up a little bit because this place is just needs pickup like I said earlier um, but I'm glad I was able to get some content because like this week is gonna be really gross and rainy which sucks I also just need to start eating a little bit better and working out because I don't really have any excuses like with grad season or anything like that. Like I actually have time to do so, so I need to get back in the gym. But like right now, I honestly do not have much motivation to do so. We will see how that works out, but I'll definitely be filling you guys in on my weekly vlogs. They're starting back up tomorrow and I swear they're gonna be good. So definitely subscribe if you guys are not already. And if you are already subscribed, to make sure your post notifications are turned on. And if you wanna see content in real time on Instagram, Instagram, TikTok, I'm on pretty much every social platform. Um, most of them are so underscore gnarly without the G. So I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.